Now, have you ever had this happen to you? You've got a C or C++ program in Visual Studio. You try to run it in a console. What happens? The console window pops up and it vanishes again so quickly you can't see what's happened. Let me show you how to fix it. So first of all, go to uh, Project Properties, so Project, and you can either get the properties from this menu or if you've got a multiple project solution, just right click and go to Properties. Then you go down to Configuration Properties, Linker, and down into System. And if this subsystem is not set, your console window is not going to stay on screen. So you need to set this to Console and then this subsystem Console here. OK. Run it again. And this time it pops up and it says, Press any key to continue. So I got the chance to see what the output is and shut it down. Still a problem though. I switch from running it to debugging it and same thing happens. Console pops down again. Different solution. You have to go to tools, options, then in debugging this time, general, and you have to scroll right down here and automatically close the console when debugging stops. You don't want that. Click OK. Now in the debugger, and this time it stays on screen. So that's the solution. The reason for it is that the different options were set in different versions of Visual Studio. Different project options are maintained in the project file. And if somebody has created a project without these defaults, then you're going to have that problem. I'm Hugh. This is Code With Hugh. If you want more tips and tricks on Visual Studio, or tutorials on C or C Sharp and other languages, subscribe to my channel and click the little bell icon. Then you'll receive a notification whenever I upload new videos.